here at Haneda. Uh, next thing we're gonna do is go find baggage claim, get our bag, then we gotta find the shuttle over to Narita. That's the other international airport here in Tokyo. And then uh, we're gonna cruise over there. I think it takes about an hour and a half to get there. Uh, once we arrive there, we'll get checked back in for the second time, clear security again, and then uh, really gonna wait for the rest of the day. We've got about six hours on deck here before we take off to Bangkok. So. Uh, yeah, we'll probably catch you on the bus. So just an FYI, as you clear baggage claim and come out here at Haneda and you need to make the connection over to Narita, right here is where you buy your tickets. And then you're really just gonna walk out there and look for the bus stop for your corresponding bus. It is a brisk one here in Tokyo and we're heading down to bus stop six to catch the connection over to Narita. C of the North Wing. It is a quiet one in here today. It is indeed a quiet one. Alright, so of the things open, Tully's Coffee here is open and I've got my own little umbrella here, my own little table. Look at this. Oh man, meritorious. I'll take a, take a look around here real quick.
and again it is dead quiet we did some traveling i guess two years ago and it was already kind of getting quiet but man this is unreal no lines nothing all right so just ordered some food some pasta here at tully's coffee probably get another cup of joe before we roll out too um and some water stay hydrated it's always important but uh yeah, we've got a good solid two hours to kill before we can check in. Uh, and then we've got another probably four hours yet before we can even board. So, yeah, get a little stretch here in, in Tokyo, Narita. Uh, we'll see what it looks like inside once we get over towards the gates. But uh, out here in the lobbies, it is, it's dead quiet. There's probably, there might be 40 people here. It's kind of scattered up and down the benches and everything, but... Uh, but yeah, I don't think much is open. Uh, my wife said none of this was open when she came through a few weeks back. Uh, so I'm, I'm glad Tully's is open. Uh, yeah, about to get some decent chow. And then uh, here in two hours, we'll check in, hit security. Hopefully the tie pass and everything's good. And hey, bickety bam, we'll get rolling. See ya. All right, so we're in. Thai pass uh, made muster. Uh, passed the test. We rolled through customs. Uh, eerily quiet in here, just like uh, every other airport setting that I showed you earlier. Uh, going through actual customs customs to leave Japan uh, was like walking into a basketball gymnasium and there being three people in there. You, the lady that's helping you sign your sofa paperwork, and then the guy checking you at the desk. Um, but yeah, you're really quiet here. Got everything a grown boy needs right here. Right, found me a nice chill place in here, no shortage of space. And like when I say there is no one in here, I mean there's no one in here. There's the cleaning crews walking around, there's security making his rounds. There's a guy passed out in a recliner over here. And I think there's like five to 10 people on this flight with me going to Bangkok. We'll, we'll see if we'll see if that population gets a little deeper, but uh, man, it is insane quiet in here. Just. The, the seven was literally the only thing open. Uh, McDonald's is closed, Starbucks is closed. There's a, there's kind of a sandwich joint behind me. It's, it's shut down. Uh, the toilets in the 7-Eleven are open. And then whatever restaurants lounge I'm using right now, I guess this is Starbucks kind of, maybe it's just a common lounge area. I don't know, but I'm gonna sit here and have a cold brew and see what happens. But uh, got like an hour to kill before we board. Damn, that's good. Uh, there was a little bit of a hang up when I checked in <clears throat> and I'm not quite sure yet if I want to blame uh, Kiwi.com, but uh, I, I remember booking baggage all the way through on my initial flight from Okinawa to Tokyo, Haneda, and then again from Narita to, to Bangkok, but I guess that didn't carry over or something got lost in translation, but uh, as I went to check in here, uh, I was that guy that got hung up at the counter uh, while people left and right of me were checking in, uh, you know, lickety split. Uh, they said there was a problem with a payment that didn't go through uh, for my reservation. Uh, so I, I looked it up on Zip Air's website and, and sure enough, that's, that's what it said, but uh, booked and paid completely through, uh, through Kiwi before making the trip. I booked this way back in December uh, and I get to the counter and find out that it didn't all go through. So 
or, or it was paid for, but not the baggage uh, somehow. Uh, so I had to pay for baggage again. Uh, yeah, not sure how I feel about that. But, but it may have something to do with my original Skymark flight being canceled too from Okinawa. Um, I had to reshuffle and get a JAL flight uh, two days prior to the trip. So, yeah, that was a. Those were the only two real big hangups. But the, but the time pass beyond that was good. Uh, got through, no questions asked. Had everything they needed. Uh, insurance, you know, you know, again the whole the whole collection of of, of documents you have to have. Uh, cleared customs, made it through. I'm just marinating right now until it's takeoff time. So. Next stop, Bangkok. We'll see you there. Peace. We are on the plane. We're boarded. I think I'm counting like 10 people on this plane right now. Excited. So much space. Unreal. How did they break even?